Welcome to Rybrook BMW Worcester, Adrian Reed speaking. Here we have the Mercedes Benz uh, C250 AMG Sport Edition Premium, Premium Plus Automatic VN64 FFW, a bit of a mouthful that. Uh, in silver, uh, with looks like black Alcantara. Uh, it's one owner from Newton, 16,000 miles. Uh, very, very pretty car. Let's have a walk around it, starting with the near side corner. Uh, looks fine, looks lovely. A couple of very light stone chips, but uh, literally nothing more than that, as you'd expect, probably at 16,000 miles. Looks very nice. Uh, moving round to the uh, offside front corner, the wing looks all good. Uh, nice pretty alloy wheel there, lightly curved, just on the edge, unless it's a bit of lack of corrosion, I'm not sure. And here, a bit round on the badge, maybe that's a warranty issue. Um, tire starting to go a little bit thin on the outer edge, but certainly a good four or five millimeters of tread in the centre. Looking down the off side of the car, looks fine, very clean and straight. <coughs> Doesn't seem to have had any paint rectifications as you'd expect, but there are no dent masters in there either. Just a couple of light chips there on the uh, <coughs> driver's door edge. Looking at the rear wheel on the off side, that door looks okay. And tire there, probably three, so I'd say probably three to four millimeters of tread tops. Uh, moving around to the rear bumper, all looks fine. Looks very clean and straight, no problems there. Supplied by our local dealer in Worcester. Uh, looking in the boot area, obviously got the first aid kit there. I don't know whether these have a spare or not. Yeah, it's got a space saver spare there. All complete. It's a very clean car, really just wants a bit of light prep and then it's straight on the uh, forecourt with a bit of luck. Looking down the near side of the car, Looks fine, absolutely straight. Again, rear tyre, probably about four millimetres, I would say, to maybe a touch more on that one. And the rear wheel on the near side has got a slight kerb mark, but in general, looks very, very nice. Car's lovely, really. I mean, it is only sort of, what, a couple of years old now, so um, let's have a look. Coming down near side wing, yeah, that all looks good. No problem there. Front tyre, I'd suggest had a new tyre there recently. Uh, all edges are all good and a good four or five millimeters tread in the uh, in the middle but the the front wheel on that uh, near side is curbed two or three places actually so definitely wants a little bit of uh, light fettling on the wheels moving around let's have a look inside the car it's got nice sort of blue and white stitching on the seats looks like it's some sort of Alcantara there in the uh, front I suggest probably part electric seat Let's have a look in the back. All looks nice and clean, got the proper Mercedes over carpets in it. Uh, we've got two keys. A um, few scratches on the sill there as you get into the uh, driver's area. Uh, again, put the proper over mats in. But uh, all looks very nice. 16,349 miles. I'm not a Merc specialist, so it might pay to get an independent spec check on this car, but to my knowledge, uh, I think it's got command waiting for the screen to come on um, let's have a look here we go let's turn that on Mercedes Benz I presume that's got come on there it's got navigation etc which is all working heated seats what's the air conditioning um, big panoramic roof there which looks nice I don't think it actually opens but uh, I believe the blind comes across too which is what a probably standard specification um, looking around we've got a full handbook pack here uh, I've got a, a registration document showing one owner from new, registered on the 18th to the 10th, 14. Um, so it's one owner from new supplied locally. I've got a service bill here for um, its service done at in October 15 at 12,396 miles, it's cost of £252 at our local Mercedes dealer. So uh, there we have it, very nice, pretty. C250 Coupe diesel uh, on the 64 plates. It's Adrian at Rybrook. If I can move any further help, please do give me a call 07879 643 807. Thanks for watching.